The beluga whale is a highly popular attraction in aquariums for its adorable features and gentle temperaments. But the white whales held in captivity tend to live only half their normal lifespan and die early, prompting animal protection groups to call for their release into the wild. A white whale with a smiling face swims leisurely through the water. The beluga whale has been the main attraction in a large aquarium in Yasu since 2012. There were three beluga whales, but on Monday, a 12-year-old male named Louis died. He appeared healthy, but started vomiting the day before he died. The beluga whale is a near-threatened species that has an average lifespan of 30 to 35 years. But in 2016 and 2019, a 5-year-old and a 12-year-old beluga died in the Lotte World Aquarium in Seoul, followed by the young male in Yosu just this week. The beluga whale is capable of diving down hundreds of meters, but the aquariums only provide depths of less than 10 meters. Animal protection groups demand the two remaining beluga whales in Yosu be released into the wild, just like how the Indo-Pacific bottlenose dolphin Jedol was freed from Jeju Island out to the sea in 2013. 돌고래들은 거기에 완벽하게 적응해서 새끼까지 낳고 잘 살고 있거든요. 그래서 자연 생태에도 기여하고 있고요. 야생에서 살던 동물 다시 야생으로 보내 야생으로 보내주는 것이. Aquarium officials claim the beluga whale's water tank is larger than what is specified in the regulations, and the animal's release is a matter to be discussed with the Expo 2012 Yosu Korea Foundation.